this is Lulu Martin. She's a snuggler. And she's always thinking you have food in your pocket. And it took me a lot of coaxing to get her to lay down or to sit down on the fuzzy blanket over my sleeping bag. That is Ling Ling Martin. And we're surrounded by beautiful babies. And my kitten is eating. His name is Thomas Chester. And it's a tote of books with beautiful wasted art on top. Sophie's in on the, in the TV room with Mr. Bird, Pretty Bird. She's on the top shelf of what would be my closet, but uh, most of my doors are still in a shed. But I brought in one, two, three, three doors. Uh, one's going in front of the window in the first bedroom we call the girls' room tomorrow. And then there's another door that's going to be going in front of the window that I still hope open because I had a gas leak this morning and so they turned off my gas going to the furnace that had been off for three weeks so I wouldn't blow up. So back to waiting and see if the government will send someone, a plumber, registered plumber, to find what is leaking gas. It doesn't make sense to send a plumber, but, you know, I don't know. So, I tell them I have no heat, but it was 65 today. Isn't that amazing, Lulu? I think that's amazing. I hope that Penny gets, um, uh, she's looking, wants to get a trailer. I hope she does. And then my friends can go and live with her. And I can go and see them. Lulu Martin and Ling Ling Martin and my Daphne, who is just a big teddy bear and a lover. You sit down and she's all over you. She just loves to show her affection. Up there is my Theodore. And she is such a good mom. She's taking care of a kitten right now. This little one was one of a uh, roost. I'm keeping two of roost kittens. Um, so, this is Ben 3. I like to reuse good names. Well, I'm going to bed. It's seven, it's, I think 9.30. I tired. Oh shoot, I have to call Ruth. And then I'll go to sleep. Good night.